Welcome guys, it's Ayush here, get ready because there's a lot of exciting stuff lined up in this video. So, one of my subscribers is a competitive player who likes to experiment with different gaming combos on the Poco F1. He personally recommended this amazing combo to me, in this combo we have Para Android V6 Gaming ROM plus Orion V2 Kernel plus Stream Thermals plus GPU 757 drivers for Poco F1. This gaming combo is a full package. First, I'll discuss the installation process of this combo, because many newcomers might not know how to properly install the GPU drivers or thermals. Then, I'll delve into the basic features and performance of this ROM. Lastly, I'll address its touch response, battery backup, and heating. So, let's dive in. Regarding the installation process of the ROM, you'll need all these files for this combo, which you can find in my Telegram group. Use the latest TWRP system X recovery, then head to the wipe section and wipe Dalvik, cache, system, system X, vendor, and data. Next, navigate to the install section, and first install firmware 12.0.3 plus ROM plus Magisk 24.3 plus DFE file. Once all four of them are installed, proceed to install this Dream Thermals. This thermal is compatible with A13 ROMs only. Now, only the GPU drivers are left to install, but before doing that, go to the mount option and mount vendor. After mounting vendor, proceed to install the GPU drivers. Once the installation is complete, wipe Dalvik and cache, and reboot to the system. Now, set up your device, and after that, it's time to install the kernel. Simply go to TWRP recovery, flash the Orion V2 kernel, and reboot. Now, you're all set. To manage the kernel, you can use the FDEAI app or FKM Level 2 Magisk module. I highly recommend using the FKM Level 2 Magisk module, as it also enables HDR Extreme settings. Now, let's discuss the basic features of this ROM. Para Android V6 is not built for looks or customization, rather it's built for smoothness and performance. It's a system X based ROM with Android version 13, and it's enforcing by default. You'll need to use Magisk Hide to use banking apps in this ROM, so make sure to update Magisk to Magisk 27. Now, talking about performance, it's mind-blowing. It scores over 247,000 CPU throttle scores in performance mode and provides stable FPS while game. Nikal ja, busy hai. Nice. Now, let's talk about battery backup, heating, and touch issues. If you're using it for daily tasks, stick with its stock kernel for over 12 hours of battery backup. However, with the Orion kernel and stream thermals, my battery backup was around 8 hours, and the heating while gaming reached 44 to 46 degrees centigrade. Talking about touch response, it was smooth and there were no touch issues, so you don't have to worry about that. If you want more cool gaming combos like this, be sure to like this video. Let's aim for 100 likes for another exciting competitive gaming combo based on Android 10, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel.